Yo, what is up guys? Welcome to the Difference 2 Solo Titan Guide. So, there's going to be timestamps in the description below so you can skip to a certain part if you would like to. Let's get on with the video. Alright, so first things first, the stats you're going to need. As you can see on the stat list here, you're going to be wanting at least 25 jog speed. Now you can do this by getting level 25 jog, or you can do this by getting, you know, like three jog and then a couple of items. But as you can see, the time chasing me here, he cannot hit me as long as you constantly keep jogging. He cannot hit you. That's why you're going to be wanting 25 jog, because with sprint, eventually you're going to run out, and then you're going to be having problems. So get jog is so much better than sprint anyway. On to the next part. Alright, so onto the next part, the weapons. I highly recommend taking a rifle. As you can see here with the three rifles, the uh, Lee Enfield, the M1 Grand and the Mauser M59, they all have a 13.5 headshot damage. The reason this is important um, is you want to be killing the zombies in the room in one shot. You'd want, you do want to be one shotting them to the head. The M1 Grand is the best one because it's only got 2.5 second reload time. The Mauser and the Lee Enfield, either of them are great. Obviously, the Lee Enfield is better than the Mauser because it has double the amount of ammunition in a clip. But both of the reloads are kind of slow. You can kill the Titan with whatever you want, you know, machine gun, pistol, like, literally shotgun, anything. But you're going to want a rifle for killing the infected. So try to get some headshot damage, stack some infected damage, and just make sure you can kill them zombies in one hit. First things first. You want to be clearing the infected, getting rid of all the zombies that are coming into the room, but you also want to be watching out for the Titan. Don't let him get too close, don't like... He's not going to be able to hit you anyway, just don't stop until he stops. As soon as he stops, get an aim, bop. Get another aim, bop. You know what I mean? The only zombies I can't kill in one shot are the, uh, the green fat ones, all the rest will die in one hit. So you just play your time, play it safe, don't do anything silly, wait for him to stop running. Get your reload in when you need it, bop. You know what I mean? Give the uh, Titan a, not a little knockback so you can get another shot off on the zombies. Ma uh, maximum accuracy and aim speed. I'd say ma maximum accuracy the most is extremely helpful with the Titan fight. I mean extremely helpful. But now, let's get on to fighting the Titan. So when you're fighting the Titan, as you can see, he does this little arm swing. You want to wait until after he does that before you take a shot. I've got no bullets, so I'm going to wait. Get a reload after he stops running, get a shot on that zombie, get a knock back, finish off the zombie, keep running. Now we can't knock him back yet. We also knock him back any second now. Boom. Like I said, you gotta wait for him to go for the swing. And then after that, that's when you wanna spin around and take the shot. And that's that's all that's to it guys. Just play it safe, play the time, make don't forget, knock back, you can only knock back a boss. I think it's like once every second or two seconds or something. Like, I wait until I do a lap around the room. So I'll try and knock them back in the same spot in the room all the time. Like, that was a miss. I'm, <laughs> I'm shocked I didn't die then. But yeah. I'm going to let this fight play out. But yeah, that's all the tips I can really give you. Make sure you got the jog speed. Make sure you can take the zombies out in one hit. Rifle is a 10 out of 10. Any of the three rifles that I said, the, M the Mauser M59, the Lee Enfield, and the uh, M1 Grand. M1 Grand being the best one. That's what I'm using in this video. I hope this helps you guys. I really do. Because I know some people still struggle with this. But I'm going to let this fight play out. I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Peace out.